Settle Stories always celebrates World Book Day and this year we couldn't do it in the usual way. So we usually send storytellers into schools in Settle and across Yorkshire. And instead we went online. So we did a digital performance with one of our favourite storytellers, Alia al Zugbi, who's a Lebanese storyteller. And she told three stories, three lesser known stories from the Arabian Nights. So we ended up having 30,000 people watching the show today. So it was definitely provided us with a silver lining because we would never ever get that kind of engagement if we were doing it live and in person. So I think it is really important to do kind of focused, targeted outreach work with communities, whether they be rural, whether they be urban. I think all communities can benefit from tailored kind of direct delivery community outreach work. But at the same time, going digital and opening that up can also be really interesting and exciting and also make the communities proud of the organisations that are in their area. So we've been, Settle Stories has been adamant throughout lockdown to provide more social connection, to provide free storytelling events, more so than ever before, really. It's kind of lit a fire under us to kind of be like, we must reach people, like people need this now. Because that's kind of what art is. It's like, you know, storytelling and art, it enhances life and it reminds us, you know, that we're human and that we want to live and experience great things. So. That was the main reason. We just didn't want to let World Book Day be spoiled by COVID.